Okay then guys, welcome back again to another Fox Tech video. This time we talk about how you can go ahead and make sure your iPhone updates its apps automatically. So what you have to do is to make sure that you are of course logged in with your Apple ID and all the stuff which is required to even download apps to begin with. But once you do that, go to the settings like this and I just want you to scroll down a bit towards the bottom and here is the App Store. So go ahead and click on the App Store and essentially the three toggles right here are the most important ones. So of course, automatic downloads. Now the three of them are completely different, so pay attention to those. So app updates is probably what you are interested in the most. So automatically install new app updates. So if you have this turned on, Make sure that you keep it at that way because it 100% does automatically download and update your apps. Okay, but besides that, you have the app downloads, which you don't have to keep turned on. So let me explain what that does. Essentially, let's imagine that you have like a different iPhone, whether it's an old one or any other device that you use with your Apple ID. And if you download some apps on that device, when you have this toggle turned on, it will automatically be downloaded on your iPhone as well. So all of the devices will just get the latest apps. It may be a useful thing, but I don't really like it. And also you have the in-app content, which is essentially like a background refresh for the app's content. So this essentially just drains the internet and battery a little bit more but it has nothing to do with updating to the latest versions of apps. It doesn't get you like the latest version of the app, only the latest version of the content inside the app. So this is all that you need to know about it. You may be a bit confused because there is also another section inside of your profile at the top right here. So if you go to this, you also have like the media and purchases. You have the app store section here as well, but you have to set it up right inside of the settings right here at the bottom. So that's about it. Hope you found this video useful. Make sure to hit the thumbs up, subscribe below to the Fox Tech YouTube channel, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace out until then.